everybody welcome back to my channel today it is thursday the 29th of october and i have a full face of makeup on for a change oh my god i've got makeup on who is this girl like i literally feel as if i've not had a full face of makeup on the glam makeup as well may i add in ages but i feel like a girl again i have a little bodysuit on excited so i am going for a meal with my mum my sister my grandma dad and both grandmas and they were going to a place called the last zebra in carlisle and um, it's like a nice restaurant i don't know if i've been before because in carlisle there's a few restaurants which are owned by the same people i've dressed up all nicely i've got my body suit on from primark my black pants are from new look i think and i'm gonna have to choose a bag as well but i'm kind of thinking in my louis vuitton in my little chair and I've, hello i'm also gonna be wearing in my white converse which i've not worn in ages because it's not sunny anymore and like it's light but it's not sunny i think it could be raining i've curled my hair especially i did get my hair cut actually and i, I like it shorter i feel as if it makes me look older as well so i got a trim but when i got my hair cut i nearly fainted this is not a joke or anything i did actually nearly faint um it's because you know, when i get my hair cut i have to stand up because of my height and like the length of my hair um and i had a face mask on as well which didn't help and in my eyesight it started to go really black and i could hardly see anything and then i asked my mum for a glass of water and as soon as she put the glass of water on the table i literally it was about to fall back and my mum and my hairdresser had to catch me and sit me down on the table so i mean on the chair i mean so if, if that was not a good experience if the time before that one when i got my hair cut i went dizzy as well but i didn't almost faint so you must be wearing face masks maybe it may be standing up for like a long time i don't know but i'm all ready to go the table is booked for quarter past the one and i think we're setting off in five or ten minutes so i better put my perfume on pack my stuff in my little bag put my trainers on and stuff so yeah i'm excited now, these hair curlers have they're probably like seven years old and they do smell of burning a lot so every time i curl my hair in my room just smells of like a fire is that a bad thing because imagine if i just set a light one time and i don't even know about it or i burn my hair like that is not a good thing to think about anyway i'm not going to take my speedy bag i'm going to take my multi check bag i've been to work as well today i feel like i'm talking a lot but i just have a little bit of things to update you on i went i was working this morning i've now finished because I was working five until, but because, because I was on overtime, I was working five until like 11 kind of, but I finished at quarter to 11. So that is happy days. I'm taking this if back of me because she's one of my favourites. But does she look all right with this? I don't know if she does. Let's test this bag. Or do I take my Gucci bag, which I like as well. Or do I take this little one? Which ones everybody think? I'm kind of thinking the Gucci bag for a change. I don't, I'm not quite sure. Yeah, I think I'll take this one and pack my stuff in there. And I'm going to take a quick Instagram photo as well. So in case you're wondering how I take my Instagram photos, I take them all on my phone. Sometimes I, I place a phone on my tripod on my camera and take some photos with the ring light as well. But my mum has just messaged me. If I've got any concealer, so I'm going to have to give her in some because she wants some. I'll give you my trusty uh, Revolution one. In C3, I, I do have a bit of tan on, hence why I do look a bit more darker today. I'm a, and my teeth are like white. But yeah, anyway, I will probably might vlog at the meal if I'm not too awkward. But if not, you'll probably see me back in here again. So I'll see you right now. We're here now and I've got... Frozen cocktail of actually ripple. Yes. I'm gonna show you my food because it oh my god it looks amazing. I've got the fish and chips. Nice. Yes. I've just got in guys, it was actually 
it rain outside hence why the hair is a bit more flatter now but i am home i had a lovely meal with my family my grandma's kindly paid for it I bless them so that was very nice of them so if any of my grandma's watching this thank you very much for the meal it was very lovely and if you live in cumbria or are visiting carlisle in time make sure to go to the last zebra make sure to book if you want to go there for food and drink because the drinks are really nice and the food was amazing as well so i highly recommend going there but i actually gutted that my hair is going to be a bit wavy now because i curled it all nicely and stuff but you know it's fine anyway it is nearly five o'clock and i'll be going to sleep in four hours so that's fun because i'm working tomorrow but i am just going to be doing a tiktok because i don't know if i've told you guys but basically i am selling my gorgeous coral or poly dress on i was selling it on instagram i decided to put it on my facebook market page and i did you know i put it on for 20 pounds i put a picture of me wearing a dress because i felt as if it, i felt as if it was good to actually like put up like a photo of me for reference kind of thing because that's better to do it like that and then <laughs> someone have you already told this story i don't know if i've told this i don't know if i've told this story but if i have i'll cut this out anyway but anyway yeah so if someone messaged me and said oh do you come with the dress so i put but no and then I screenshot it and put it on my snapchat and I said um i'm only trying to sell my old poly dress and then like i put the screenshot of what he he sent me and then i think i, I took a screenshot of his facebook page i'll put like a picture and like all screenshots of what i put and stuff i edited his face onto my face with the dress and i said the coral is not his colour oh my god it was so funny he had to be there in the moment and yeah, watch my stories to realise yeah, what I was going on about it don't make sense but yeah anyway with that being said my room is a bit of a tip my mum was a little angel last week and I had a couple of bin bags in my room full of like home bits and clothes and stuff and she actually like it took them to like the the bins for me bless her so now i don't have as much like stuff on my floor but it looks as if i'm opening like a bag shop because i've just got all my bags on here which I need to put away and i've got some washing stuff for all the joys the joys the joys and also exciting news it, it probably won't be happening for like a, a little while yeah but i've been talking to my dad about you know, potential cars because i'm thinking of maybe getting a certain type of car like it's my first ever car because i don't actually own my own car i use my mum's and pay for petrol for the car at the moment purely because she doesn't use it that often so it's good for me to take it to work and go to scots and stuff but i've been having to look at like a few different cars but there's a certain type of car i really like and for brand new it's a really good price but obviously like i don't know if i'd get the newest car out there kind of thing because it'd be a lot of money but it is something i am looking into so yep yeah, it may be by next year i might have a car of my own depends on what my job is like and what i'm doing and whatever else but it's excited <sighs> i'm so tired i don't know if i should but i got a deal from the doll beauty five pairs of lashes for 10 pounds I think I showed my last vlog, but if you're not watching my last vlog, you need to watch it as well. I got five pairs of eyelashes, two a limited edition pair. So I got Honey, a gorgeous pair. I also got Poppy, another limited edition pair in Darling. Are these very similar to the tiny the teal four ones I've got them at the moment. They can't come off in the corner though, excuse that. I've also got Bella, which are nice. And finally, I think this is Jerry. So that's all the lashes I got. But the packaging is so nice, and the quality of Dolby lashes is always a 10 out of 10. So, yeah, it's a good little deal. But I'm all stocked up for my lashes for a good few months now. So, that is me all happy. I'm a happy gal. So, yeah, but anyway, I'm going to do some editing because I need to get as many things uploaded as i can i was going to film video today but obviously i can vlog instead but me and my family 
are going to Cheltenham yeah, this Sunday as I'm filming this. They will be going away, so I will try to vlog because obviously I won't be able to film like any main channel videos as such there. But I might bring my camera for photos and maybe try and maybe try and vlog on my camera as well. But yeah, I'm gonna vlog in Cheltenham because we are we are going to be going to the the Cotswolds as well. So it's very exciting, and we will be doing a bit of walking and visiting places and. We are going from the Sunday until the oh what day? The Sunday until oh my god I am so tired. From the Sunday until the Friday and then I'm back at work again. So I'll be finishing work at twelve on Sunday and then we'll be going straight there. So I'll track my bag tomorrow. Um, if because I'm seeing Scott on Saturday like after work for the last time for like a week. It'll be really weird to not be able to see him for a week but yeah but speaking of scott i'm gonna go and facetime him before i forget um because you know i haven't spoke to him in a good few hours so it's about time i have been sat in my room making a tiktok because that is what my life has come to please follow my tiktok it is alice l holmes i'm currently on like 700 followers which is pretty good for me i'm pretty proud of myself but i'm gonna give you a mini home bargains haul probably the worst home bargains haul you guys will see but you know i, I want to show you so firstly i bought some nail clippers for 59p because mine were actually broken yeah i needed some because they're handy for cutting your toenails with because you know we all have to cut our toenails and i was lost when mine broke on me so these are 59p they're probably some of the cheapest nail clippers you find but you know it's fine and then also got a paddle brush because I was in need, I was in need of a new hairbrush and this is made with a biodegradable wheat straw so it's basically made with like wheat and straw and stuff so that's quite cool and I like a good paddle brush and this is like the one fifty nine or something I think so I'm pretty chuffed you know I've got myself a new hairbrush. And paddle brushes are my faves as well and it's a nice little colour actually it's a cute little hairbrush you know and it's it's kind of helping save the planet a bit so that was good i then also got a pedicure file because i've never actually had one of these before and i think it was around 99p and i do get a, like it's gonna sound really disgusting but i do get a little bit of dry skin on my heels and the side of my big toe and i can never get it off with a pumice stone so i'm hoping it'll work and it'll be it'll be nice to use on my feet i'm actually test it after this in the bathroom obviously and not my bedroom it gets a bit grimy but yeah the whole bargain actually has some really good beauty stuff in so I have a look and it's really cheap and then finally i've got some 10 bin bags for 129 because me and scott are going camping in a week and a half and we will need some bin bags to basically put stuff in like a rubbish uh possibly like i don't know toilet waste maybe uh what else there's, there's stuff to put like dirty shoes and clothes in and a 10 of them for 129 so that's all i got from more bargains uh, very exciting as you can tell but you know it's fine it's all right you know i need i needed to treat myself to a few little things that's what i did i'm going to taste this hairbrush now and see what it's like oh, wow oh, that is a good hairbrush oh my okay if you want a hairbrush which gets all your knots out first time it actually is like i don't even have to go over it either oh my god so good i definitely go to all bargains it's such it's really pretty as well wow it's so good and now my hair looks wavy as anything now. Oh my god, this hairbrush has my life. I love it. What a very exciting haul. I am going to be doing some YouTube. I will also want to take this makeup off soon. I've also FaceTimed Scott, so a mission accomplished. I just need to chill and relax a bit before I have my tea. I don't know what I'm having my tea. I'm not that hungry because we did have our lunch at probably like around two. So yeah, I'm not really in the mood for food at the moment. 
Plus, I did have a chocolate orange brownie. Amazing. It had bits of caramel on it, and it also had strawberries with it as well. It was so good. Like, if you know me, you'll know. I love my chocolate. I love brownies. I love anything chocolatey, pretty much. So that was a treat. Well deserved. So, yeah, but... I don't know what I'm going to do now. I really don't know. I just feel so tired. Update on my cactus plant. All the flowers have actually died now. So that's them there. They're all dead. Yeah, pretty much. All my cactuses are doing amazingly well. I do have a big one. Especially this one here. It's just, it keeps on growing. And this one as well. But this one seems to be dying. It's actually tiny. So I might have to chuck it out. Um, yeah, but yeah, I've, in my windowsill is literally full of cactuses, but you know, I've had an obsession ever since I was around 15 years old with just collecting them and looking after them and stuff, but they have stayed alive for like four years now, so I'm, I'm proud to say that I am a very proud cactus mum. We've been able to make one of them flower as well, which is very hard for most um, the plant, the plant owners to be able to do, but yeah, I feel happy with that. I'm going to put my specs on. Should have gone to Specs Savers, you know. I think a vlog already went up as well, so please make sure to keep on watching there. I think it was when I went to Newcastle with Scott and went to the Dog Cafe. If you've never been to the Dog and Scorn in Newcastle and you're going to visit the Newcastle, definitely book the Dog and Scorn because the dogs are so lovely. So cute. But yeah, I've got I've got a lot of stuff to do, but I'm just kind of you know, chilling here. Let's see if I don't have anything to do, but I really need to get a move on because I'll be feeling sorry for myself if I don't get... St stuff done tomorrow but i'm actually thinking of filming a pack with me kind of video because i just have an obsession with some material on youtube at the minute guys and her holiday vlogs i kind of just say amazing she's unreal you know i even though she's younger than me i look up to her as like a good youtuber like she, she's been on holiday and she's vlogged every single day of her holiday and been able to upload them like how amazing is that anyway i'll stop hyping her up yeah. yeah, but she usually films a pack with me type of videos and because I'm going on holiday, I'm kind of thinking I could do a little pack with me but obviously I think I'm just going to be bringing my whole doll. I will have to pack a bit of me, I'll have to bring my laptop and, and my camera with me and stuff so that's going to be quite good to pack them. But yeah, I do need to free up a lot of stuff on my SD card so I better do that. Um, all boring stuff, you know, but I, I'm actually chuffed with this, like... I'm going to use it because I bet it'll feel so nice on your feet. <laughs> I look bald with no eyelashes on, but, you know, we're going to roll with it. Also, eye glow is slowly coming off my eyes, but that means that I'm going to take my makeup off, end this vlog here and have a shower and probably go to sleep because I will be up at 4 o'clock in the morning, which I am super, duper excited about. I just can tell from my face, but... If you, have, if you guys have enjoyed this vlog, please make sure to leave a thumbs up. It would be nice to get to a like goal of 30 likes on this vlog. Also, leave a comment if you have enjoyed and also subscribe. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye, everybody.